Police are still investigating who planted a potential explosive in downtown Columbia this afternoon. Thanks for being with us tonight at 10. I'm Deborah Kendrick. And I'm Lucas Geisler. Central Bank tells us police found what looked like a grenade in a flower bed in the 700 block of East Broadway. Luckily, no one was hurt. ABC 17's Kennedy Miller is live in Columbia. Kennedy, you spoke with CPD and it's still investigating that device. Deb Lucas, people told me there was a large police presence all around the 700 block this afternoon. People also say police had the sidewalks blocked off for nearly 45 minutes before leaving the scene. Columbia police are still trying to figure out who buried a potential explosive in a flower bed this afternoon. We had just received a report from an individual um, that a bomb was discovered um, in that flower bed in that area. The individual who called in was an employee at Central Bank, a business right behind the flower bed where the device was planted. Mary Wilkerson with Central Bank says they saw something weird around noon today and found what looked to be a grenade. Wilkerson said it wasn't a grenade, but police say they're still looking into whether or not it could actually explode. Now imagine walking down this sidewalk during one of the most busiest times of day and not knowing that there was a potential explosive sitting right over here in this flower bed. Now above the flower bed, there is one camera that could have picked up the suspect. We asked the police department if they were able to pull any security footage, but they said they couldn't answer this question. They did tell me a bomb tech arrived and secured the device without any incident, but it is still unknown how long it was buried, why someone would do this, and who was involved. I think, you know, it's important to clarify firsthand um, that this was a straightforward situation, you know, no threat to the public right now. And I spoke to a few businesses downtown and people that witnessed the event tell me that they were shocked. People that didn't even know what was going on downtown were just as shocked. Reporting live in Columbia, Kennedy Miller, ABC 17 News. Kennedy, thank you. And as soon as we learn any new information, we'll continue to keep you updated right here on air and our website at abc17news.com.